Well, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, laughing boy here, and uh, well, I got good news for you. We just got new screenshots and details for the upcoming gun running DLC, and let me tell you, it looks really, really good. From what they've shown us so far, it looks awesome. And, uh, well, uh, let's get right on into it. Now this is basically their splash page. This is on, this is directly from the Rockstar Newswire. Um, it says first details and screens for GTA Online gun running. The man here doesn't look all that remarkable. He uh, does seem to be wearing a new hat and new gloves. I don't know about the shirt, but the gun seems to be uh, pretty unremarkable. The car, on the other hand, is a tam is an armored Tampa with a gun on top. Now that is exciting. As we go to the story itself, it says, while sharply dressed CEOs trade special cargo from lavish air-conditioned Swedes and leather-clad bikers on the roadways moving illicit consumer goods, new opportunities are opening in a highly lucrative and equally malicious network hidden underground, ripe for takeover by the VIP CEOs and biker bosses of Los Santos and Blaine County. Now here we get into some juicy information. Uh, first is that little, par that little bitty paragraph right up there at the top says Southern San Andreas illegal weapons trafficking industry rises to the surface in gun running. A massive new update coming this June to GTA Online, of which of course means that we are the earliest that we're going to get the DLC is. June 6th, which is a little over a week away. Um, hopefully it's not going to be too much more than that. Hopefully it's only going to be a week away. I think it's going to, uh, because I, I myself am looking, really looking forward to it. But that gives us time to do some, uh, to do some grinding, get some money up. Because it, it looks expensive. And, um, well, uh, more juicy information and more, uh, you know, <laughs> along the lines of why I, I say it's going to be expensive is in the next paragraph. It says, dotted throughout Blaine County are hatches. Look into these mysterious properties on the Mays Bank foreclosure site and you'll find sprawling underground headquarters for sale. It's sprawling, you know. <laughs> Okay, ready to be stocked with new military-grade vehicles, which, of course, we've already seen a couple of them. Uh, um, and weapons manufacturing equipment capable of developing highly sought-after offensive, offensive and defensive technologies. Now, <laughs> I don't think this is going to mean that we're going to get free weapons or free weapon upgrades. But I do think it means that it is possible, at least, that we can get free ammunition. Now, um, I think that would be really cool. You know, much like the, the snacks with the CEO office. And, uh, you know, while, yeah, it's not going to be exactly free if you're paying millions of dollars for, uh, for the facility, and all the amenities that go with it. Um, <laughs> if you're like me, it's going to save you a lot of money because I have spent uh, oh, on several occasions uh, I've spent more than thirty thousand dollars in ammunition just in a free mode war, and that's I mean I don't mean occasionally I mean <laughs> really quite often. I have friends that uh, that will have will blow a hundred you know over a hundred thousand dollars in a day just killing people you know in free mode lobbies uh, <laughs> anyway um now uh the next thing i want to talk about is this next piece of equipment that looks really really interesting that i'm probably going to love and hate at the same time like many of you um well, it looks like a uh, well, it's a, a piece, an APC or a um, a light tank 
but it seems to have a SAM on top, a surface to air missile system on top. So, <laughs> I think that uh, all of you who like to go in and terrorize lobbies with Hydras and Savages and Buzzards, or should I say all of us, because I have been known to do that. Well, I think that we're not going to like this thing so much because it looks like it uh, may be able to uh, take down some aircraft. But it looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. It says, uh, now, it, what it says here underneath there, it says, Stay tuned for more on gun running, including specific business and research opportunities details on massive tactical full service mobile operation centers uh, that might be possibly might be the aircraft carrier with new weapon upgrades and deep customization that sounds good all new weaponized vehicles and more yes definitely definitely interesting very exciting and here we have uh, we have one of the one of the facilities inside the base uh, target practice. It's a, a gun range that you can have inside your bunker. It's going to be really cool. Uh, here we are. Here we have the uh, the Tampa, the weaponized Tampa. Uh, it looks. I don't know if that is an armored vehicle like the um, well, like the Duke of Death, or even the insurgent but it does look like it has some bullet resistance to it and it definitely has a gun on top and it of course you know you see the uh, the the push bumper on the front it looks like it's going to be dangerous and a lot of fun and people are going to love and hate that i'm sure of it and the last thing we have is really interesting as well. It is <laughs> an aquatic APC. Uh, it says the APC is equipped to handle all terrain and water. I like the way it's put, uh, that that is put, all terrain and water. But uh, and so I guess it's literally, uh, well, uh, if you could make the thing fly, then it can go anywhere. But that looks it, that looks really interesting. Looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, it's going to make uh, probably going to make the uh, piracy prevention a little more interesting. <laughs> anyway, um, so that's all of the photos that they have so far. Um, I would expect that uh, actually would expect that that we're going to be getting more information before I mean that they've actually said we're going to get more information uh, soon I'm hoping that uh, we're not going to be waiting too long for this DLC but uh, it is Rockstar's pattern to you know to give us some information and then wait about a week and give us more information and then wait about a week at least until we get the new the new DLC but uh, the earliest that we are going to get this appears to be on the 6th of Tuesday. No. <laughs> Tuesday, the 6th of June. Anyway, please remember to leave a like on the video if you liked the video. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Lapping boy out.